What's up you guys, this is Rob from the Gay Guy Plays, and today Dress to Kill is getting steamy with a little information on the newest Tenogen skins and how to access them. Now for those of you who don't know, Warframe has given its players the ability to submit dev selected weapon and Warframe skins, as well as all new models for helmets and Cyandanas to the Steam Workshop. Which means that at this moment, all Steam Workshop Tenogen skins are only available on PC. Once a skin or new mesh is posted, all players with access to Steam can vote on what they would like to see in game, hopefully grabbing the attention of the dev team. Now I'm not 100% sure how long each round lasts, but DE takes a look at the current offerings, approving the best candidates for in-game implementation. Now at this current time, Steam Workshop Tenogen skins are solely available for purchase with real-life currency, which the creators receive a 30% cutoff. DE has stated that they are looking into how this could possibly work with Platinum, however no promises have been made, so don't get your hopes up. Now, for those of you who have no clue how to access these Tenogen skins because your market looks like this, it's going to be because you're launching Warframe independent of Steam, like I personally prefer to do. Now, the unfortunate reality behind this is that you must download the Warframe client through Steam and launch it through Steam, which will result in your market looking like this. Now, you'll be able to select the Steam icon and begin your shopping spree. Just keep in mind what I said before, that this does cost real-world currency, which means that you'll have to link some form of payment to your Steam account. In addition, as I had stated previously, I'm not a big fan of launching Warframe through Steam, so if you're wondering, I do currently have two Warframe clients loaded on my computer, both of which have to be independently updated. So basically every time I want to do a Steam Workshop 10 Gen shopping spree, I have to update all of the files that I was missing since the last time I launched it through Steam. All in all, a small yet mildly annoying price to pay the fashion gods. Now if you've made it through this far in the video and have no clue what Steam is, baby I'll leave you a link in the description box below. Create an account, download the client, it's safe and many of us use it, a good portion of us against our will. So that about wraps it up, hopefully this was helpful to those wondering why the hell these weren't showing up in their market, and be sure to share this info with anyone who already doesn't know. Take care, and as always, stay drop dead gorgeous.